What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Pidgey here, aka Nature Boy Fitness. Hope you guys are staying home, staying safe, you know, avoiding all the drama outside. In today's video, we're gonna be talking about how to make a homemade mass gainer shake for skinny guys with no whey protein. Typically, 800 calories. Guys, I know it gets tiring eating a lot of food, you know, eating chicken, fish, you know, it's just, it's just tiring to keep eating a lot of food. So what better way is it to just make a mass gainer shake and just drink the calories rather than eating it and chewing it? So in this video, we're going to be uh, covering all that. Hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you guys will be notified when my video drops. All calories and macros are run into the nearest tenth. So the ingredients we're going to be using here are 1 cup or 250 millimeters of whole milk, 150 grams of strawberry flavored Greek yogurt, 50 grams of strawberry ice cream, 1 cup or 150 grams of fresh strawberries, 50 grams of whole oats, one banana, and one tablespoon of peanut butter. Since now we have all the ingredients, we're gonna pour it into the blender. Starting with 250 millimeters of whole milk, which has eight grams of protein, 12 grams of carbs, and eight grams of fat with 150 calories. Then we're gonna put the banana, which has one gram of protein, 24 grams of carbs, and three grams of fiber which has 100 calories. Then we're gonna put the one cup or the 150 grams of fresh strawberries, which has one gram of protein, 11 grams of carbs, and three grams of fiber, total of 50 calories. Then we're gonna put the uh, 150 grams of strawberry flavored Greek yogurt, which has about 12 grams of protein, 14 grams of carbs, total of 100 calories. Then we're gonna put the 50 grams of strawberry ice cream. Mm -mm -mm which has 2 grams of protein, 14 grams of carbs, and 5 grams of fat, total of 110 calories. Then we're gonna move on to 50 grams of whole oats, which has 9 grams of protein, 34 grams of carbs, 4 grams of fats, and 5 grams of fiber, total of 200 calories. Then we're gonna put the last ingredients here, which is 1 tablespoon of peanut butter, which has 4 grams of protein, 4 grams of carbs, 8 grams of fats, and 1 gram of fiber, total of 100 calories. I'm just gonna go ahead and blend them. Now while it's blending, I want to go over the benefits of this shake or smoothie. The first benefit of this smoothie or shake is that it's full of antioxidants because of the strawberry. It's full of calcium because we're putting milk as well as the Greek yogurt. It's high in protein because of the Greek yogurt, the milk, you get the peanut butter in there, you also have like the oats. Most important thing here is that it's high in energy because those guys that are bulking, that are trying to gain weight or trying to get a lot of energy at once. I mean this, this is 800 calories is just full of energy and it's just natural foods we're using so it's extremely high in energy it's perfect for a pre-workout the fifth benefit that it has is that it has a lot of essential healthy fatty acids which is from the peanut butter it's about eight grams of fat which is just amazing because your body needs that fat the sixth benefit is that it's high in fiber so you're gonna be full for a very long time maybe about two hours two to three hours maybe maybe even longer and the seventh benefit is just it's delicious guys it's just delicious if you guys love strawberry mm -mm. You guys are gonna love it. All right, once it's done blending, we're gonna pour it out. The total calories here is about 810 calories. The total macros you consumed was 37 grams of protein, 113 grams of carbs, which is good because you need the carbs to uh, have the energy and to gain the weight. We have 25 grams of fat, and we have 12 grams of fiber. So this way, if your insulin doesn't spike, so you don't store fat. So that way, this energy will be more uh, into your bloodstream. And when you guys go work out, those have tremendous amount of energy. So that's the beauty about this uh, shake and smoothie. Straight out whole foods and just delicious, yummy, tasty ever. And there ain't no protein powder in here, guys. But I do want to mention here is that after I poured this into my cup, I noticed that I had another two cups left in the blender. So. Uh, what you see here is one cup that I have, one glass, 250 millimeters. You can say that after blending all this and how the ingredients and all that kind of stuff blended in, has a total of 750 millimeters. So you're going to have three servings of it. But you can have it, you know, throughout the day, maybe one in the morning, afternoon, evening, or you can have it all at once right before your workout, well, two, two or three hours before your workout, or have it as a meal, but sip on it slowly for 30, 40 minutes. Same thing, really. If you guys are going to try this out, let me know in the comments. Let me know how it goes. Let me know how you guys feel, because I really want to know how that goes. I mean, I feel fantastic when I have this. I feel like I could go pull a mountain after when I have this shake. It's just, it just, it boosts my energy in a very very healthy way and i just feel like it's time to uh go pull some mountains or go do like 500 pound deadlifts so yeah guys let me know in the comments what you guys think like the video if you guys enjoyed and subscribe for more and i'll see you guys in the next video